Greetings! That's Ray79 here, and I'm back with another episode of Let's Play Pokemon Really Diamonds Part 51 Post Game Completing Pokedex Bare Minimum and Getting National Dex. Okay then, let's get started. Press the A button now. And here we are, back for our last save. For those of you who watched my previous videos that came before, I had spent that time exploring the fight area in the battles, in the battle zone, and also catching the three legendary Pokemon, Mesprit, Azelf, and Yuxi. And now I'm off to complete the last entry of my Pokedex. Pokemon 150, Palkia, and reporting back to the to turn my report to Sandgem Town. So even though Palkia cannot be encountered or caught here in the Brilliant Diamond game, there is a way to obtain his incomplete Pokedex entry in this game. So first, flying out to Celestic Town. Off to Celestic Town we go. And we're off. And here we are in Celestic Town. Thanks for the lift, Wild Star Raptor. So first, you gotta go to the Elder's House in Celestic Town. Go around here. Oops, wrong house. Sorry about that. Come on, coming out. Okay. And now, just going up here, circling around, and do this big house here. Go inside. Going to the left side of the house and talking to the elder here. Well, hello! You look well. I did some research of my own since that spot of trouble last time. Mount Coronet acting up had me very concerned too. Well, this is what I found at the shrine. A book. It's quite old. See for yourself. And there it is. A picture of Palkia, one of the other legendary Pokemon. It reads... Palkia, the Pokemon that binds the spatial dimensions. It seems there were two Pokemon in ancient Sinnoh. They respectively stood as symbols of time and spatial dimensions. Okay. Well, hello, look well, this is research of my own. The same dialogue and showing Palkia again. Now let's check out my Pokedex. And with that, 150 Palkia. And I've just about covered the bare minimum of seeing all the Pokemon in Sinnoh, all 151, so with my objective clear, let's head off to Sand Gem Town. Flying off here to Sand Gem. And off we go! And here we are in Sand Gem Town. Thanks for the lift, Wild Star Raptor. There's Dawn here. Hi Terrence, may I see your Pokedex? Oh my gosh, you've seen every kind of Pokemon in Sinnoh! Have you shown your Pokedex to Professor Rowan yet? Nope, not yet. Alright, let's go up inside the laboratory. And here we are, let's talk to Professor Rowan there. Ah, Terrence, you've come to show me the progress in your Pokedex? Yes. Hmm, you've seen 151 Pokemon. Bravo, Terrence! You've recorded all the Pokémon of Sinnoh in your Pokédex. This will help immeasurably with my studies on Pokémon evolution. Oh, someone's coming! Who's that? Oak! Greetings, Professor Rowan! It's been a very long time! Oh, it's Professor Oak from the Kanto region. I'll tell you, Sinnoh certainly is a long trip from Kanto. Of course, if it means meeting new Pokémon, there's no distance too great for the likes of us to travel. Oh, but it's not my old colleague, Professor Oak. I should have expected as much from the world's authority on Pokemon. We always used to joke, when there are Pokemon, you'll find Oak. It's good to see that it didn't change one bit. Professor Oak, let me introduce you to my young assistant. This youngster has filled every page of the Sinnoh Pokedex for me. Ah, well, very glad to meet you. As you've heard, my name is Oak. I've been hearing a great deal about you from Professor Rowan lately. Aw, oh, shucks, really? 
He's been exuberant in praise about a fantastic young trainer. I see that you live up to know that you've suppressed his praise. You've also got an impeccable sense of timing. You see, I had an errand to run Professor Rowan on my visit here. He's asked me to bring him the data for the National Pokedex. And since you're here, let me upgrade your Pokedex with the National Mode. After all, there are many kinds of Pokemon in this world of ours. My Pokedex has been upgraded to the National Mode. I'm afraid it won't be easy to complete the National Pokedex. However, I'm sure you will make an honest attempt on our behalf. Have no fear, Terrence will get the job done. By the way, Professor Oak, what compels you to visit this region? Ah, yes, I've heard that Ravenous Park is now open. If I recall correctly... Remember correctly, it's at the end of Route 221. Ravenous Park is a special system that attracts every imaginable kind of Pokémon from every region. I've come to make certain that system is operating properly. Terrence, you should make an effort to visit Ravenous Park too. Oops, I'll be late for my meeting if I don't get going. Okay, it was a pleasure seeing both of you. Bye now. Yep, goodbye. And he's gone. Off he goes, busy as ever. Now, Terrence, I have a gift here for, as your reward for completing the Sinnoh Pokedex. I attained the Poke Radar. Put the Poke Radar in my back's key item pocket. That's the Pokemon Radar, or just Poke Radar for short. Use it and it will indicate grass patches where Pokemon are lurking. I prepared that to help my field assistants put together the Sinnoh Pokedex, but you took care of that. I'm sure it will be useful for your goal of filling the National Pokedex. Okay, thanks a lot. The world is immense. There are many more Pokemon. That means there are many more thrills for you to seek and enjoy. Oh, goody! It's real something! Imagine cataloging every kind of Pokemon in the Sinnoh region. And in complete contrast, there's Dawn. Anyway, you've been great for the props for Pokemon Evolution Research. Uh, thanks I guess? Yes, that's correct. Professor Roa has been studying Pokedex systems with Professor Oak. Okay, let's head out. What's, what, what's that? A hole! Oh, it's Rourke! Hi there! It's been a while. Yeah, it has. When I heard that you've defeated the Elite Four and entered the Hall of Fame, I rushed straight here to congratulate you. I mean it. Great job. Ah, oh, shucks, thanks. All of the other gym leaders are really happy for you, too. But you know, we gym leaders aren't going to take this line down. Losing to you was rough on all of us, yet we still have our pride in Sinnoh's eight gym leaders. Now we're all determined to beat you this time, so if you don't mind, could you give us all another chance of a Pokemon battle? We'll be waiting for you in each of our own gyms. You know where to find me, or for gym. And he jumps us down the hole, and the hole has... Okay. Hey Terrence, have you ever chatted with my kid sister? Uh, no I haven't, should I? My next objective, try adventuring all over the Sinnoh region. Okay. Let's go to Dawn's house and do what Dawn asks, talk to his little sister. Oh hi Terrence, there was a news on TV saying there's a massive outbreak of Pokemon. That'd be great for filling up your Pokedex. Oh really? I'm checking TV. This is Helena, bringing you on the spot weather. Route 216 has been badly hit by a brutal blizzard. Some of you may brave the weather in hopes of finding rare Pokemon under these extreme conditions. Be sure to dress extra warm and don't fall asleep out while you're out there. That's all for the weather, brought to you by Helena. Hmm, Route 216. Okay. Oh wait, what's this? A lot of snubble have been spotted on Route 219. Two... Wait, Route 209. Sorry about that. Route 209. I guess now rare Pokemon will start popping up all over Sinnoh. Over here, okay. Okay, just about finished up here. Finished getting my heads up. Oh, Terrence, are you acquainted with Bebe? She lives in Heart Home City. Every trainer should make a point to pay Bebe a visit. Another task from Dawn. Let's just head on to Bebe's place. Let's see, where does Bebe live again exactly? Hmm.
Let's see. Where does she live again? Hmm. And we're flying off to Bailstone City. Okay. Oh wait, now I remember. Baby lives in Heart Home. Sorry about that. Going to Heart Home City, flying off. Okay, here we are. We're just going to find Davis' house. There she is. Hiya! Been a long time. How's it going? Using the PC boxes? Yep, that's right. Oh, now looky here. That's a national Pokemon XMC. Good for you. You'll be using my boxes like crazy if using that now. Well, I always thought a good trainer ought to juggle boxes smartly, so I should be the one to say so. Oh yeah, do you want a Pokemon called Eevee? Yes, please. Here you go. Now you'll be good to it. Oh my gosh, I got an Eevee. Nice. Yeah, Eevee, the evolution Pokemon. Normal type. It is a rare Pokemon that adapts to harsh environments by changing its appearance and capabilities when it evolves. Would you like to give Eevee a name? Hmm, not now. Thanks. Send it to a box. That Eevee I gave you? I got it from a good maid in Johto. Who knows how many Eevee he's raised over the years. Oh, nice. So let's just check out my brand new Eevee. Let's see. Box one. There's Eevee. Lonely nature. Impetuous and silly like spicy food. Soup. Superior physical attack, inferior physical defense, ability, adaptability, powers up the moves of the same type as the Pokemon, meaning normal type, tackle, growl, tail, whip, and sand tap. Okay, let's just move Eevee over to here. Alright, then... Let's fly back to Dawn. Does she have any more tasks she wants to give me? Back to Sand Gem. And here we are. Hi Terrence, how's your Poke Radar? When you use it, do you sometimes see more than one patch of tall grass bustling? The patch further away gives you a better chance of seeing the same kind of Pokemon in a row. That's the feeling I get anyway. Oh, that's helpful. Any other advice? Sometimes a batch of grass sparkles when Poke Radar is used. People say a shiny Pokemon is hiding there. Could that be true? Hi Terrence, I'm Poker Radar, and we're back to the same dialogue. Okay, I guess it's that, I'm just about done. So, first off, I guess I gotta. Okay, stop in here. Sorry about that. Hang out. Okay, here. And with that, that's about all the time we have for today. First off, I wanna say thank you to the viewers for watching today's video. And I hope also you all sure also stay tuned for. When I upload more videos again in the near future, I also hope you show support by liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing to my videos and channel. And with that, I say goodbye and.